As we continue to mark the celebration of Black History Month, we take you to a center dedicated to helping the LGBTQ plus community in the Bronx. And as Cindy, CBS 2 Cindy Shu reports, it's a special place where everyone is welcome. Sean Ebony Coleman is the founder of Destination Tomorrow and says he's the first African American of transgender experience to operate an LGBTQ plus center in New York City. It's a place that provides services rooted in economic empowerment. GED, job readiness, professional development, financial literacy and partnership with TD Bank. I wanted to give folks sufficient tools so that they can go on to tomorrow and be successful. Sage Rivera is Destination Tomorrow's director of programs, but first came to the center years ago as a participant. It was refreshing to find a place that sort of spoke my language and people that looked like me, and also to be able to find a place where I can be open in myself and not be judged about it. The center also celebrates the pioneers who came before them, including two of Stonewall's leading activists, Sylvia Rivera and Marsha P. Johnson, who started Star House in the village in the 19th the Star House was a space for um, runaways that used to hang out on the pier. They could go there and get whatever services that they needed. But they were the first ones that recognized the need in housing within our community. So the Star House was, was, was born. Destination Tomorrow also finds housing for those in the LGBTQ plus community and works on helping to turn people's ideas into action. Destination Tomorrow is a place of not only of safety but of ideas where we help foster them to grow without judgment and find like-minded people that will meet you where you're at and help you get to where you want to go. A place where you're treated with respect and dignity. We hope that the word continues to spread um, far and wide that the Bronx has an LGBTQ center for the community, by the community, and open to all. In the South Bronx, Cindy Shu, CBS2 News. And the goal is to open Destination Tomorrow centers across the country. We will continue to have stories throughout February highlighting the contributions and sacrifices of African Americans who helped shape our country. They'll be here on CBS2, and you can also find them streaming on CBS News New York, as well as CBSNewYork.com.